Want to spice up a video? How about adding just a little bit of electricity? If you want to switch out your cursor for a different object or a custom object, you can go up to the top right hand corner and select the cursor properties. From here, you can change the scale and opacity of your cursor. There is a drop down option where you can switch out your cursor for any number of different objects. Under this drop down option, you can choose from some pre selected options. One of the most exciting options are neon, which gives you a large selection of choices for neon based cursors. From here, you'll see the neon cursor follows the traditional cursor path. Notice all of the objects on my timeline on the video block. These represent every time the cursor changes. If you want to replace your normal cursor with a neon cursor all throughout the entire video, you can go right here to select the all option. This will change every cursor moment in your video to the neon or selected cursor of choice.